Hello. Hello, Button Bashers, and welcome to Fire Button. This is Gekirinden. And I'm Jay. And I'm Harry. And I'm Steve. I'm so, so glad you and said that. And not that me. it's. Uh, yeah, Geki Rinden. Um Well, we kind of haven't really covered a lot of shmup games for a while since last shmup re- shmup appreciation. Yeah, and we've only got like a few days left for this year's yeah, shmup appreciation March month. Yeah, March is almost over, so let's get some shmups on the go. So yeah, this is Geki Rinden. I've not played this one before. You should have left the title oh, card oops, in, sorry. man. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, thought well. that's what we were doing. Yeah, we've got Start. the title animation, but no card. No, uh, L1. That's, that's like the arcade start button. <laughs> the actual start button on the controller is, is a menu thing. Harry is sunglasses man, I'm assuming. Yeah, I'm, I'm just sunglasses dude. Yeah, I can do that. AD3195. So I imagine the goal is shoot things, don't die. Yeah, shoot things, don't die. Uh, it's the shoot, shooting and bombs, and that's really, um, really it. And admire the pretty uh, visuals. Are they power ups? Oh, are they? Are they good? Those are points. Oh, those are points. Okay, yeah. yeah, I can do points. That's a power up if you want it. That's a power up. I'm already shooting for. Okay. <laughs> Not that that really sort of matters. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> now, how are you shooting for? for? All right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no. That's okay. You you can have the next view if you like. Oh, but look at the spread on that though. Aren't you glad that I'm your friend? It's yeah. nice to see a schmuck that's set in space. It's not, oh, we've seen a lot of air, type, motherfucker. Well, no, but we've seen a lot of Air Force ground-based stuff lately. Last shmups I've seen have all been yeah, earthy. a lot, a lot of them like um, and I, you know, imagine I'm pronouncing this in quotes marks. Um, a lot of them like relatable settings, you know, like very earthy ones. What's the thing on the on the right? Should I be worried about it, or is it just it's, background? It's background. Oh, that's good. Whereas okay. this is a bit gundamy. And Jay's yep. got a biplane that shoots missiles out of its Ah, oh, shit! Oh, great! Oh! You died. Uh, it was, okay. I thought it was going to sit in the middle of all that, and then it all homed in on me. Well, I think what we're, what we're basically going to end up doing right here is um, sort of just using many continues and doing a playthrough, because, you know... Why well, not? Well, it's casual. Arcade game, isn't it? We can be casual. At just, least we don't have to spend quarters on said continues. Yeah. Just to clarify, Jay's the green thing and Harry's the blue thing. I am the green biplane. My yes. one is blue. Which is cool. Harry likes blue. Mm. Okay, I was already firing four. Yeah. I'm having the next one. Yeah, I t- yeah. I just didn't want to be naked is all. I want to help. Okay. Uh, are you sure? Right, is the entire ship vulnerable or is there like a pleb that we that's the weak spot? Uh, I've no idea where the uh, hittable zone is. Right, gotcha. So, assume your entire yeah, play, ship. Play yeah, it safe. Yeah, play yeah. it safe. I gotcha. Because this is this really is like baby's first Dan Maku, so I was wondering Kinda, if, if maybe yeah. there was a peanut that was a, the soft spot. Yeah, the guns just melted into hands. Wrists. Move out of the way of his hands. Hands. Hands that shoot homing missiles. Hands. Can feel soft as your face with my green fairy liquid. I'm pretty sure Doctor Robotnik stole the plans for this. What do, they, what do you call the hands? Liquid metal death things, because they keep reshaping. No, aren't they nicknamed in the Sonic community? Uh, Malicious hands. Fingers is the name of the song. That Malicious Fingers, oh, okay. Oh, the, uh, big, the... Big Arms? Yeah, it's Big Arms, the, um, the actual big name. Big Arms, okay. Yeah. They're only named... Ah! <laughs> I told you to watch ah. out of the hands, and then I, I'm right into the hands. Yeah, I missed the hand, but I wasn't expecting them to Your come back. Your name is Ba. 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 That's fine. Ba. Ba. Well, there's only one Adum. So. Yeah, it's, 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 there we go. Adum. Oh, I suck. I used the continue already. What was that? Wait, we have smart, smart bombs? Yeah, we have smart bombs. What was that? Oh. Square button. Wait. Yeah. Oh, man, yours is like the, the, the Tatsujin or Truxton sort of bomb. To us laymans who don't know what that means. Yeah, what, what the mean? heck was that? The, that's a different shmup. <laughs> okay. That guy's confused. He's got no power ups to attack you, and is making. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think this is like end of the stage. Rainbow I'm hole. I'm still shooting it anyway. Team Rockets going down the plug hole again. Yeah, that's, that's like a time warp. And <coughs> if we were in the Enterprise, we'd be scanning that anomaly. Yeah. Well, here we are. We're in the anomaly, and and we're out. Your your character has fabulous hair. Yeah, yeah, and and. and uh, a fucking ascot, Fabulous. or an ex-chief, or whatever. 
like Freddy from Scooby Doo. Nineteen forty two. There you go. Steve. I wonder if that's a reference. Oh yeah, to the the schmuck, nineteen forty two. Yeah. That was made by Capcom, right? Yes, it was. And this this is this game is Taito. Ah, uh, balls. Yeah, nineteen forty two. Um, oh, bollocks is pretty much a. Uh, it's it's like a grandfather to these kind of games. Imagine so, what it must be like in World respects. War Two, fighting against some weird ass spaceships that just sort of like turned up. Ooh. Ooh. Where are you? Awesome. Oh, you're putting your name in. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Harry, whatever that weapon is. Nah. It was great while it lasted. Yeah, well. Yeah, that was. Oh fuck. That was like, uh, <laughs> like the Raiden blue laser. That's another shmup. I, I, I'm just basically gonna. We can't record many shmups this year, so James is gonna name them all. Just shmup, shmupopedia. I, I'm shmup dropping right here. <laughs> Uh, cannons, cannons. Printer. These well, are probably oh. like some oh. o- like some other schmop. <laughs> I, I am really bad at this. If in doubt, square button for your for your skull bomb. Ah, uh, yeah, I should remember that. Yeah, um, it sort of mentioned this is like baby's first damaku or bullet hell to uh, non-Japanese people. Uh, should I try? But uh, bollocks! You guys really aren't getting very well today. I tried a different one. Yeah, well, Harry, I, is he's red. I did. I did suck. Pretty sure the Germans didn't have a walker. I think I'm still in like twin stick mode, to be honest. So uh, I'm not thinking schmup shapes. Yeah, and I'm, my brain is still so. Yeah, from work, I think so. this game is is pretty uh, pretty riding, to be honest. The uh, the blowing up the tanks. Ah! I didn't the, see that plane and leaving there. the little uh, glowing mark. That's that's very riding. The World War Two setting has all of a sudden made me think of those train those train tracks in the World War Two setting has made me want to play World of Tanks. That Thanks, guys. Oh, World of Tanks. Oh no! If anything, you should be playing under under defeat. Under defeat. No. If I remember right? You, Mike, and Adam sucked at that game. Uh, was it Mike? I thought AD was on that. I can't remember, you know. Whoever it was. They Someone might have to go back and we, watch we the Under Defeat video. We, we did you know. suck, you know, because um, it was a game I'd never played. So, you know, I was sort of getting right in it. And Eat Bomb. It's one of the few shmups that are on demand for the Xbox Live Marketplace. Yeah, um, Under Defeat is really good. Especially so when, uh, and I know some hardcore shmup players are going to tell me off about this. But when, no. you put, when you put it onto twin stick mode, it's a fucking dream to play. And I didn't know that when we did the video, you know, because if we did it again, and I think we should do um, some of these things again, um, uh, I yeah, am, I, I will put it on. I am stick. really terrible at this. I'm supposed to be like the guy who loves schmops. Well, yeah, the thing is, a lot of these schmops were just basically going in blind because there are so many of them, and there are only so many hours a person can spend ah, on bastard. games. Yeah, I'm going back to my blue you one. can't play all the games. My blue one's the best one. I'm basically uh, in that ship. Well, I was. Well, clearly you want it's to be the in the big one, green clearly. one. It seems to be laying down a hell of a lot more suppressing for you. I will probably oh, pick the green one. I think generally I'm actually not... Bomb. I am so not good with co-op shmups. I, I fare much better single player. Yeah, it's it's kind of weird that you'd think. I, th- I think if you knew the game like um, sort of really well and you had a good synergy with the other player, that you'd probably do well because filling the screen with more bullets. But Smoking's in, bad, kids. Yeah, in, <laughs> in practice, no, because... I don't know, it just fucks up your shit. Yeah, uh, you know, you've got some other player all up in your space, and, you know... AD 1999, so this will be uh, right the in the future of, of the developers. ...of Gulf War 2. Ah, oh, for... F- Fine. No, actually, shit, no, 9-11 hadn't happened. Uh, this is... Yeah, uh, yeah, no, that happened in... 2000 and something. 2001. Yeah. I was going to say 2011. No, it fucking No, didn't. this is the Cold War, isn't it? Or 1999. The end of the Cold War. 1999. I don't know. No, there was. Fuck I failed all. history. 1999 with a vampire war. There was fuck all <laughs> war going on in 1999. <laughs> vampire wars, war. Steve. I, I don't you remember it. your bloody um, Dawn I've of never... Sorrow, Curse of. Oh uh, yeah, um, Dawn yeah, of Sorrow? yeah, yeah. The, the the Demon Castle War. Yeah, Demon Castle War. That's the where, one where they finally finished off Dracula, only for Dracula to be reborn as some. I Cruise. actually dodged shit. Are you proud of me? You were dodging shit to Castlevania references. I'm very proud of you. <laughs> okay. I mean, I, I was smart bombing the hell out of that because, well, I may as well do since an average life on this lasts about. A oh! Second. 
Should have used the bomb. Tits. <laughs> Given the closest oh, thing to you. an open world shoot 'em up is Soviet Strike and Desert Strike, things like that. Uh -huh. uh, if by open world you mean open well, a couple of fields. You get what I'm way. saying, though, right? They were sort of freeform, um, very pre open world, if. You know, if if you will, because but, uh, you know the thing I really liked about the original Desert Strike is if you knew the levels well, you could often do. <laughs> my apple booming. Uh, you, know, <laughs> you could often do things out of order in Desert Strike. You know, if, if like certain things would just be quicker doing them in one order. And I still think the best one, Soviet Strike. Nah. The the fan favorite is usually uh, Jungle Strike. I uh, I gotta say I like the original Desert Strike. It's only four levels, but I, I don't used know, all it's... my dodging spoons earlier. <laughs> I'm use I'm useless now. What about Urban Strike? Oh, Urban Strike, the one they couldn't put on EA Replay because one of the uh, one of the missions involves blowing a hole in the side of one of the two towers. Oh, Shit! For fuck's sake! Sorry for going divergent. I realise we are talking about a very different game to what's on screen, but yeah, I'm just trying not to die, which I'm failing at not dying. Trying to find a way for me to relate. I mean, the only other shmup I've really put decent hours into, besides R-Type, and even then, that wasn't a lot. You like R-Type uh, Final, though? Yeah, it was all R-Type Final with you, wasn't it? Was R-Type old... Final is pretty awesome. <laughs> was an old 486 shmup called Zone 66. You know what? We should hunt that down and DOSBox that shit for I a video. I think it's on Steam. I'm not sure. Well, I think it's on Steam. There are some good shmups on Steam. If I it's mean, not on Steam, I probably ought to find it on GOG or somewhere. Some people would probably say we should probably do Crimson Clover one March because that one that gets a lot of good press. I have no no idea what you guys are talking Crimson about. Crimson Clover is like Jay's name dramatic. dropping all the schmops. All the schmops. Well, yeah, I, I love you this type of game. Schmops. I'm not very good at you this love one. Every but... kind of schmop, but you can't can play all the schmops. Bum. Yeah, every time you go in a town tunnel, I'm just picturing bum 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 bum. Bum, 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 yeah. Oh, are we half past the future? Yes, two, three, <laughs> seven, three. Half past the future. Ah, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You died. <sighs> so that that red thing is obviously in the background. Yeah, it's it's not very clear. I've got a wide spray of popcorn. Oh here. look, I suck ass. I I suck ass really good. That's Great. a sound bite. <laughs> Oh, I miss our type. Just remember, kids, Harry sucks ass really good. I'm trying to think what what, <laughs> what, what oh, yeah, yeah. consider myself actually any good at. Probably next to none, although I'm, I'm fair at um, Death Smiles these days. And I, I don't entirely suck on uh, our type Delta. The back KOS oh, but those guys are pretty awesome on Delta. That is a game, that is a shmup we can co op. Yeah, we, well, mind you, we do pass we, the pad we, on Yeah, there, it's don't pass we? the controller. It's not a simultaneous. No, it's not. No. We did want to uh, sort of do uh, Parodius. Yeah, Parodius, Fantastic Journey, the second Parodius game, which is um, simultaneous. Uh, wow, you guys suck. That's why I've put ass. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Under this long motherfucker, look at me. I'm the long. helicopter. Oh look, I got, I got friends. <laughs> It's not the best thing when you have fr friends. Oh, no. I to make that some this has just evolved into noise now. I'm, I'm sorry. That was some expert butchery of the English language just then. <laughs> See, I'm, oh, just, the, I'm oh. just a spectator to this, and it's just look at all these like 90s robots. You fucking Look love 90s robots. 90s I, I like robots. 80s robots, Joe. I was, I was about to say, the only thing you like more than 90s robots is 80s robots. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Actually, I'd say I was the 90s robot fan because of Virtual Arm. Uh, I, I don't mind the Armored Core games. I, I would like to do a Let's Play on that, but I don't know how I'd do it. I'm not particularly a robot fan, to be honest. Whoops, sorry, I, I meant to only pick one up. <laughs> the only robots Harry likes is Bonnie in his dreams. No, I do not. <laughs> you know, it wasn't even... Oh. The background is falling away. This this is some serious shit right here. Ah, uh, that's going to be a big was, thing, isn't it? was a Sega Saturn era, you know, PS1 era type thing. And you can see it with uh. some of the backgrounds moving. Oh, fuck. We got swarmed. We you, did. You uh, might want a smart bomb. Uh, oh, there I am. Whoa. No, I did that. <laughs> it's Fucking firing Hadoukens. <laughs> yeah, pink Hadoukens. Fabulous. Yeah. Oh, that, yeah. That's the guy from the start of the game. 
The one Them shoulder pads. Time traveling. Yeah, we've been chasing See, it. See, that's PS1 stages. texture shit there. Yeah, yeah, it is. Back in the Super NES days, they would call that Mode 7. Hmm. Bless you. Mode 7? Yeah. What does that mean? It was a screen mode the Super NES had that... Um, what well, was the seventh they could do? <laughs> Apparently, mode number seven, yeah. It could oh, do what? Ah. rotate, um, sort of, uh, f- big flat landscape stuff. Bomb! I know of two uh, games that used mode seven. Star Wing and Vortex. Star Wing didn't technically use mode seven. Well, because got me! It had oh, a co- and a It had the um, co-processor. You're thinking of Super FX there. Oh, my. Which was um, Star Wing, Vortex, Stunt Race FX, Doom, Yoshi's Island. Oof. Huh? Uh, what's the one F Zero and Mario Kart used? Ah, was that, oh. mode seven? that was Mode Seven. Yes. Uh huh. Thanks, Dad. I, I, I appreciate the information. Are we just smart bombing the shit out of it? Yeah. And trying to dodge all the peanuts. I'm out of bombs. They look more like corn. Shit. So I would ask Harry's opinion on this particular schmuck, but I think it's just a case of. Whoa! It's all right. <laughs> I, I think it's, it's a little bit confusing, but not quite. I don't get quite as lost as other sort of Dan Maku. Yeah, it's that I've, it's not really Dan Maku. It's sort of a pre Dan Maku. Yeah, the projectiles are a bit too easy to get mixed up in the, the whole thing, though. Well, actually, I think these are actually a lot clearer than most modern Dan Makus, to be honest. Especially since a lot of the modern Japanese Dan Makus, you've got shit flying everywhere, and you can't tell what's enemy shots, what's your shots, what's power ups, what's points. In, mo- in, most, shit, in most cave Dan Makus, you can tell enemy shots because they're pink. Oh god, now we are really in the future. Four, the future five, is wavy. The future's yellow. Yeah. Piss yellow. Lovely. The future is that di- is that grim. The entirety of space is yours. Ah, the future's mustard. I do like how the way that the levels load in is continuous. It's not constantly breaking. That is forward. actually pretty cool. It's not stop, start, next level. Yeah, it's 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 like nicely paced. I mean, I've played this um, sort of uh, a little bit in single player. Um, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Just like single credit attempts, even though I don't really know the game um, very well. Oh, oh, I've been, oh, been trying shit. single oh, credit fuck. attempts anyway, because I'm crazy. But, uh, yeah, I, I generally get to around level three, and, uh, you know, it's, it's kind of nicely paced. I think the challenge level is pretty good. Um, just seeing how crazy it's getting now, you know, I've not seen any of this stuff ever. But seeing how crazy it's getting, um, oh. it's probably going to take some doing to do a sort of single credit run and when I say single credit it's like old arcade vernacular you know from when you had to put coins in it's the idea of uh, seeing doing how it without far, dying yeah, seeing how far you can get without rather. continuing you know without putting another coin into the machine ah. Ah, this has got to be like not near the end of the game land surely yeah we're getting a little bit Geiger-esque here that's the thing that's kind of lost from uh, from gaming now. Um, you get your kind of metagame uh, stuff where uh, people might decide, you know what, I'm going to do a no save run of Resident Evil. You know, it speaks. What, like that stream language. I did recently? Yeah, yeah, that that's like the modern equivalent of doing a one credit run on an arcade game. And there's still people who do stuff like that, though. I mean, the yeah. odd challenge here and there. I, I, I'm a big fan yeah. of challenge, challenge runs in, in principle. I, I don't really watch a lot because uh, I don't. Just, don't really watch a lot of gameplay, really. But um, someone recently beat Dark Souls without being hit. That was kind of impressive. Someone beat what? it with a fucking guitar beat here it without being hit once. Yeah, and we've all heard the stories about how brutal that game is. Yeah, right? I, I, pictures or it didn't happen. Yeah. <laughs> of course, you know you could beat Ocarina of Time in fifteen minutes by using all these weird coding bugs and things. And yeah, <sighs> yeah, by warping through uh, walls in the um, right place. See, I like the idea of speedruns in general. I don't really like the idea of glitching. To yeah, no, get I'm fast. in the same boat. You know, I, mean, yeah, I like but the idea of doing it legit. Glitchless is a category. Ah. Yeah, f- finding all these cool little things and obviously they have to be hard to pull off is respect worthy in itself. But I do, I'm in Harry's camp. I it's, do find it a bit more impressive. Yeah, it's it's basically soft hacking the game. Really. Yeah. And that's that's interesting. I like to see that kind of thing. Maybe once. I'd stay out the Sarlacc plug hole. I, I, I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't personally uh, like to see those uh, kind of things as a run. I've watched uh, aforementioned uh, Ocarina of Time run, and um, you know, with explanations, it's, it's it's fascinating, but not the kind of. To me, that's not gaming. You know, that's 
as I say, it's it's soft hacking. It's finding ways to manipulate the the, the code and the outcomes of the Whoa. code. Which is that, interesting in its own way. Yeah, that are not actual um, coding. Yeah, interesting in its own way. I did say fascinating. Mm, yeah. It's cool. Just, you know, I Rainbow. have to admit, not for me. I think you might have fired that too soon. Yeah. I got some. You've both got skull bombs. Yeah, yeah. that's because we're both the same ship. Only my one is blue. Oh, okay. I didn't realise that. The red ship and the blue ship had a face. So... <laughs> it's dead now. Space is a rainbow <laughs> ocean, and Geiger monsters with faces are summoning out of rainbow plug holes. Oh, dear. oh yeah, he's hardcore. Shit, I did it again. You swear that never happens. Uh... Oh no, I just went right into. It's like a fucking devil crash reject. A little bit, yeah. Devil you you mean Dragon's Fury, right? I mean Dragon's Fury, yeah. Oh look, there's. Giant biological gants like things from our type, only from the top now. Yeah, it was. Aww. <laughs> turrets. There we go. More turrets. Could do with the speed up, actually. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a thing that's sort of lacking from this game. There are no speed ups. I like it for the for the simplicity. Don't like it for the fact that I'm the same speed. <laughs> for I, I could do with being yeah. a little bit faster. I keep feeling like we're near the end minutes. of the game and we're not getting to the end of the game. Is this going to be final boss time? Because we are slowing down again. Mm, them colours though. Uh, yeah, they look kind of like final boss colours. I feel like we're in the magenta colour of Metal Gear Solid One's menu screen. <laughs> oh, oh shit! I was too busy looking at the background. I didn't notice the big fuck off thing. I died, Mr. Reynolds. Here you did. Go. Just like all the bombs. All the bombs, all the bombs, all the bombs. Question, is there a projectile on screen? If so, oh. bomb, bomb, bomb. He, he's changed oh, colour. I'm out of bombs. I'm become a giant, like, dragon winged death. I die, oh, shit. Burn. At least when you do a bomb, it takes ah. the projectiles as well. Yes, yes. Go on. Hey. Is, is he done? Or is it? This One more. Even my there final. we go. What's that? That, that was, was apparently his final form. This isn't even my female form. Is that the end of the game? Did we do it? I like how Harry has stayed with the same ship all but once, and Jay's like tried every flavour now. Yeah, yeah. I did I, actually try a few other ones that just didn't flavors. last very long. Oh God, we're going back in time with your friends. Yeah, did we win? Oh, is this an ending? Yay, we sucked. Well, it's better than just game over, you win. We, we really sucked. We, we did suck, but... Uh, I sucked a bit harder than you, though. I think, um, you know, if, if we're saying, like, 20 peer credits... They're doing, like, formation flying. It's it's cool. Yay. Oh, pink helicopter's fabulous. Yeah, if, if we're talking, like, 20 peer credit, we would probably spend a tenner on that game just then. Just then. I think so. <laughs> Visually, I'd say it was something different from other shmups we've seen recently. I think it's like a colour well, ikaruga. The, the thing is, we've done a fair few modern shmups, and uh, the genre is pretty much devolved into its extreme. Yeah, you but know, we don't see many lot, space opera shmups these you, days. You get a lot of uh, Dan Maku, and, and this this is a bit more pleasant than that. Yeah. Home base, giant orange space potato. I'm the protagonist. Whoa, what's up with his face? That, uh, well, why did he look like Rurouni Kenshin? I'm um, Albert Wesker's granddad. These pictures are deviant art here, right here. Seriously, I'm pretty sure the guy was just basically plagiarizing Rurouni Kenshin, even though I've not really watched it. Or I've only it, seen really. Samurai X, where he was still a murderous killer as opposed to a pacifist. What oh look, my ass is top. Yeah, but there was bomb and there was poo in the list. <laughs> that was great. That's how mature we are. Yes. Uh that was all right. I like. Uh, yeah, that's not bad. On that note. <laughs> Bye. Bye.